today is gunpowder day. Right? In 1603, King James I took the throne in England, an avid Protestant. He forbid Catholics from practicing their religion and punished Catholics who did not convert to the Protestant Church. The gunpowder conspirators were a group of Catholics who sought to take action against the king. They plotted to blow up the British Houses of Parliament. They planned to do so when the king and his supporters were in the buildings. Their plot was uncovered on November 5th. Today. 36 barrels of gunpowder were found in the basement of Parliament. Guy Fox, the leader of the conspiracy, was arrested and tortured until he confessed. Oh, the good old days. If they found him there, why did he need to be tortured to confess? Well, we probably couldn't kill him unless he confessed. <laughs> he was arrested just as he was about to ignite the gunpowder, yeah. Apparently... People in England celebrate Gunpowder Day with fireworks and bonfires. Is that true? The question is, are you celebrating Guy Fox and his co-conspirators for attempting to eliminate religious persecution? Or celebrating the government's successful discovery of the plot and thus saving many lives? I don't know. See, I don't think he was trying to make it so that every, everybody could have whatever religion that they wanted to have. I really just think he wanted to get rid of the Protestant king so that somehow he would be able to get a Catholic king in there. At the very least, it was basically terrorism. I don't think terrorism makes sense. In conclusion, no <laughs> terrorism and no religious persecution. How about that? Hey, there we go. I think it would have solved that problem. experience with gunpowder.